Um, well, it was a very enjoyable speech. Um, he is a very entertaining speaker and he had some uh, good jokes, including some good jokes at Keir Starmer's uh, expense. Uh, and as everyone says, it was uh, very light on content uh, and actually contradictory uh, on content because, of course, the idea that, uh, uh, you know, you could just uh, put up people's wages by, uh, by not relying on uncontrolled immigration. All the economists uh, in the country are lining up to point out uh, that it doesn't actually work like that. But that doesn't matter in a way. Uh, it doesn't matter how contradictory he was. He tried to uh, tried to capture the essence of uh, Tony Blair talking about the people's priorities in the NHS, and he talked about how Margaret Thatcher, who didn't actually wasn't that keen on the NHS, uh, would actually be in favour of putting up taxes, which is a bit of a stretch for some. Uh, but it does it doesn't matter because the underlying message was uh, was was very clear that he wants those traditional Labour voters who voted for him last time. To stick with him, and uh, very successful it was too, I think, at that. In saying that, we've been saying this all week, haven't we, John, about how there's frankly been no real policy at the Conservative Party conference. Uh, we know we've got, of course, the big spending review coming up at the end of this month, uh, where, again, some important decisions will be made. But do you think it was a... It clearly was a deliberate attempt, but why? Why not have any s substantial policy announcements from anyone at conference this year? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I don't know. Um, you would have thought he would want some kind of uh, rabbit to pull out of the hat, apart from a single announcement about paying teachers more, which I understand is a, um, a revival of a policy which was discontinued, uh, paying uh, teachers in, in shortage subjects in, uh, in, in shortage areas uh, a, a bit extra. Uh, that was the, that was pretty much it in the Prime Minister's speech. And you're right, there, there haven't been that many speeches, uh, uh, many new policies uh, throughout uh, the conference period. I mean, maybe that's because, you know, party conferences, um, uh, you know, aren't the sort of thing that people who are not obsessed with politics pay much attention to. So uh, the Prime Minister may think that he'll get uh, more attention if he, uh, if he announces things at other times.